Parkinson, manager of the base, which is a local community project. Um, it's a partnership between Bernardo's, Parkside Special School Trust and the Norwich Central Norwich Foundation Trust at Hewitt. We have some lovely um, ex exhibits here from Sweet Arts, who are a local community-based art group. Um, so we're lucky enough to have those in the centre at the moment, but we hope to get exhibitions in the, in the future. This is the base reception, and here we have Gemma Lord, our lovely receptionist. Hello. Who's uh, always ready to help and here to sort of listen to any ideas you might have or suggestions. We've got our very own elephant, which was designed and made by Children at a Graffiti Art um, Workshop. So they're all rather proud of that. And then we have some nice other little bits of art and design from the students here too. Okay, in the kitchen here, we just have this as a space where families can come along, have a cup of tea, chill out. And we want to get some cookery up and running. And we've also made some links with the older community, um, members of our community who want to come and maybe bake some biscuits and some scones and have some nice afternoon teas, that sort of thing. So lots of ideas for our nice new kitchen area, which is very kindly donated by Mobin Kitchens. OK, if I just take you through the centre, um, we have a nice open foyer area here. Plenty of magazines to look through and information on services, running locally and information on things in the city, really, that are happening. We have uh, an ICT room, which we're hoping to expand very soon, uh, where we run kind of adult um, education. We do a IT course for adults in here. And we also use the um, computers to load up the photographs from our photography project, which I'll tell you a little bit more about in a moment. OK. We also, just not forgetting, have our coffee morning here. That's every Tuesday. Um, any parent of a child in the area can come between the times of 9 and 10.30, term time only, and meet Sarah Spall, our parent support advisor, for the, to join the coffee morning. Okay, we have a very nice little meeting room at the centre, where we conduct just any kind of informal meetings. It's a nice place for local groups to come if they need a place to meet and have a chat about things. So, uh, yeah, come and see us if you're interested and you need a little bit of meeting space. OK, going into our main sort of function room now, we've got some uh, mums and their daughters doing face painting today. But we use this particular space for all sorts of different things, different projects that we run. Um, one of our favourite projects at the moment we're running is the Eureka Project. Um, it's a local um, sort of photographer who's running a group for parents in the area and members of our community, going around taking photographs of the Lake and Tuxed area and also now into the city working with the museum. Um, we hope to put on an exhibition in September of their work and things are all going great. So if you want to come along, sort of hopefully the second half of September, the exhibition will be up for you to come and have a look at. OK. OK, if we just go down the corridor now, this is where we hold our exhibitions. We've currently got an exhibition by Sweet Arts. Um, it may work with the charity Leeway. So some really nice work. And this is where we're going to be having the Eureka Photography Exhibition. So if you are a local community art-based group or you know you're just a local, local artist or you want to display your work, this is a great place to do it. OK. In our, one of our youth rooms today, we've got an animation workshop, um, culture work for delivering. So we've got children from in and around our local area um, learning the art of animation. So it's all very busy and exciting. Okay. We run graffiti sessions in here. We do DJ workshops. Um, we hold it sometimes as a meeting space for some groups as well. So, yeah, it's all good. So really, at the base, we do things for the community, older people, families, young people. Um, we're really open to new suggestions, and we hope that you'll come along and see us and take a look. <laughs>